Hello Fluffies! Do you think that Lolitas can't do extreme activities? Well, think again! In the new episode of Action Lolita, we're trying archery tag! Let's see if we manage to run and aim at the same time while wearing Lolita. It's time for a party in a community But not just one, a mere tea and a frippery We're going outdoors with some joy, some glee So won't you join us in active revelry? Check out your coordinates, action cross here for you Racing on a horse, climbing up a tree too Seizing life with faces glowing, always with skirts are flowing Grab that ring, grab that thing, you're in action, loaded up So today we're doing archery! So I'm looking for it, it's not the real Archery with just a bow and arrow, we're doing archery tag, so it's like laser tag with a bow and an arrow and we're in a paintball area called game area and so there's going to be a lot of uh, paint everywhere and uh, yeah. Today we are in Roulon sous Echalon, that is a little village uh, near my hometown and we're going to do archery tag. This is the first time I'm doing it uh, and since uh, I thought uh, there will be some paint on it, but not, uh, it was a misunderstanding from me, I asked uh, Joelle to lend me uh, one of her cords and uh, she said yes, yeah. so thank you very much Joelle. I'm super excited to try archery today. Um, it's a little bit cold, but not that much, I'm surprised. So maybe I can stay in a short sleeve, but I do have a coat just in case. So I put this dress, it's uh, the first time I'm going in brand to do action Lolita, it's an innocent world dress. But I already lost a button here, so I'm like, hey, what the heck? And uh, this is, uh, even though it's chiffon and it looks nice, it's borderline, so it's fine. And my shoes are really not fitting the cords, but uh, it's uh, just uh, my regular sneakers. So yeah, and uh, since for the coordinates I still had to do something okay and it's white ties, I probably won't be running in the mud and I won't be crawling in the muddy and painty grass. But yeah, I'm pretty confident it's gonna be so much fun and we'll see so it's a very simple outfit uh, easy to move in huh? and uh, i hope uh, i won't be too cold because actually it's very cold and i have no uh, coats today so i regret it a little bit but maybe if i move uh, enough uh, i will be uh, warm <laughs> yeah. so i decided to go for a kind of guru made lolita style today i hope we can choose the color of our helmets because I think a red helmet would look really cool. And thank goodness I wanted to do kind of guru since Joel splattered some paint on me. But looking at it, I think it's pretty cool. So it's not such a bad thing. And it's washable, so I don't think I'll have a hard time washing it out afterwards. <laughs> La première chose, c'est que vous avez tout un masque qui définira aussi la couleur de votre équipe. Il y a trois zones. Il y a cette zone qui s'appelle la zone de repos, celle-là qui est la zone de sécurité, et puis là, la zone de jeu. Jeu avec l'archerie, elles sont très simples. Vous êtes euh, chacun équipé d'un arc avec deux flèches au départ. Et puis ensuite, une fois que vous avez tiré vos deux flèches, vous devez aller courir dans le terrain, trouver d'autres, puis les récupérer pour tirer à nouveau. Okay à partir du moment où vous êtes touché une fois, vous sortez du terrain jusqu'ici et puis vous êtes hors jeu jusqu'à la prochaine partie. Pour tirer, ben, vous pouvez tenir l'arc avec une flèche comme ça pour avoir les deux en même temps. Et puis après, vous mettez juste la flèche comme ça. Et puis si vous penchez un peu de ce côté-là, ça évite d'avoir besoin de mettre le doigt et de vous le faire arracher par la fausse plume. After the archery lesson, it's time to get ready. The most important item is the helmet in order to protect our faces from getting hurt by the arrows. We are now trying the bows for the first time to see how it feels before going into battle. Yeah, it hurts. 
Oops. Oops. <laughs> As the bow is hurting us, we are getting arm protections and we put on our gloves because of the cold. The first battle is starting! Who is going to win? Marianne managed to hit me, so I'm out. Now it's a duel between Marianne and Peel. Who is gonna win? It's a win for Marianne! Yeah, winner! So I'm so happy, the arrows. The arrows! So we have all the arrows and I'm really happy that I I actually won! Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I didn't I don't understand how it works so well. That's okay. Two fingers like this. Mm -hmm. And then you go like this. And then I put my fingers here. And then I just go like this and then I take them off. Yeah! We decided to train a little more before the second battle starts. This time it will be a bit different. It's a Hunger Games mode. The arrows and bows are hidden in the field and we need to get them first before trying to hit each other. Gotcha. Are you okay? Yeah, yeah, you're fine. Is that it too? Yeah, yeah, you're ah, fine. Oh, yeah. Ah, yeah. Finally, something. Ah, good job. Yeah, yeah. I think I mastered the uh, things a little bit more. So. Yeah, yeah. I'm really, really oh, glad. I'm really bad, really, really bad at finding the bows and arrows, which is why I keep losing. Because I can't find them. And when I do, someone already shot something at me. Oh, yeah. So that's the only why, reason why I'm losing, because I don't have anything. But that's cool, I like this mode, this Hunger Game mode, it's really fun. Uh, yeah. No, yeah. Not for me. Super fun archery. 
Yeah. Uh, I'm really happy we could do this activity together. Definitely. The area is amazing. Oh, the, yeah. the forts and everything. It's so cool. We saw it all. Whoa. I like to try to um, to aim at someone, and uh, it's different from the laser tag because laser tag you you cannot really feel when you are aiming at someone, and here you you have you have the strength, and, and when you hit someone, it go bam. Huh? <laughs> so it's very different, very physical. Yeah. And also yeah. we only had uh, six arrows for the whole game, so you have to shoot efficient, efficiently mm -hmm. and not uh, add everything. So yeah, yeah, right. So. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. And uh, we ran so so much that uh, we didn't feel the cold uh, after all. And with uh, <gasps> yeah, the mask goodness. too, it protected us. Oh yeah, the mask was very good for the cold. Yes. But <laughs> if you're standing and there's a really good wind, it yeah. was not very comfortable because it was cold. But again, it's March, so I guess in summer it's perfect. Mm -hmm. Yeah, for me the mask was very important since someone decided to shoot an arrow in my face <laughs> it's just because i'm bad at aiming i was yeah. not really sh shooting That's your okay. face but uh, at least i hit her yeah. so yeah he was able to hit me in my hands and disarm me that oh, was wow. amazing that's good i didn't yeah. did it on purpose but uh, <laughs> good luck yeah nice, nice. <laughs> actually the first part i was a little bit frustrated because i didn't know how to to use the arrow and the bow and after a few try trials, I finally managed to, and I won some some of the games, and I'm surprised. <laughs> yeah, everybody won at least once. Yeah. So that was cool. Yeah, that was cool. Mm. And something very cool that we did was the uh, Hunger Game one, where the yeah. guy would hide at everything, and we had to run to find the thing that was so cool. I prefer this one. Yeah. You didn't, no? I did not like it because I can't. I'm not good at finding things. So they would find bows arrows and I, I would see nothing even though there was a bunch of things around me yeah i had a strategy first i saw that bill also saw the bow there was one bow really easy so, okay she's going for the bow so i will go for all the other arrows and i picked like four arrows and i thought ha, 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 i have so many arrows and then then now i have to find a bow and by the time i found the bow and i put an arrow on it then they hit me and what about your dress did it get in the way or something like that i just realized later that my petticoat was falling and showing oh. for the whole time oh, it's okay. i don't know why but it was not really a problem i guess to be in the Mm -hmm. Especially I was in sneakers. What about your shoes? Oh, I, I would in... fall constantly because of my heels. Oh, Ooh, so that's not good. Good not thing good I have a really flexible uh, ankles. ankles. I, I use Normie's boots and it goes very well. It's warm and uh, I feel comfortable. So yeah, definitely not something you should do in tea parties because no, you, are, no, you are going to ruin it. So. And fine. I would definitely play it again in Lolita because it's kind of epic. That was fun. It that was, was fun. super epic. Yeah. Pictures are awesome, I guess. Yeah. And not really in the way. But no. if you're going in the winter, maybe dress a little more more Warmly. than what we did. Yeah, yeah more definitely. Warm. I can't wait to go back here again because uh, I definitely want to try the paintball too. <laughs> yeah, yes. they're doing paintball and archery and they say they're also doing other games. Yes. Do you want to see paintball in action, Lolita? Tell us. Thank you, uh, Games Area, for your sponsoring and for offering us this uh, super afternoon. No? Yeah. yeah. Thank you very much. We had so much fun. Mm -hmm. And go try Games Area in oulon sous chalon You'll have so much fun. Bye bye. Bye bye. bye, -bye. Uh, I'm super. <laughs> Comme ça Ok. Allons, à shampoing. Next time on Action Lolita.